Houston, uh, Tranquility Base. Here's the Eagle has landed. I saw the first guys walk on the moon, Neil and Buzz, in 1969. I was nine years old, and I thought, what a cool job. Of course, I was a farm kid from Iowa. How, were we, how was I ever going to do that? I didn't tell anybody from the time I was nine, raising chickens and learning to fly and all that. Uh, I wasn't telling people that I wanted to become an astronaut because it sounded like an impossible dream. And it wasn't until the first females were selected and I graduated from high school, and that to me was when I decided, hey, maybe this is real. Maybe I really can be an astronaut. And it became um, a, a goal instead of just a dream. Peggy Whitson became the first female commander of the International Space Station. She also set records in these categories, most days in space for a U.S. astronaut, and more hours spacewalking than any other woman. She understands what human spaceflight really means when you approach it with that awe and respect and humility. It's like you're, you're, you're doing it justice. The experience of just being in space is incredibly special and unique. But to me, the, the most important perspective is perspective. You look out the window, you see planet Earth. And it gives you this perspective of how important that we're all one. And we're building this place out in space to replicate the peace parts that we have on Earth. I'm really excited to take this crew up to the space station, number one, because they're all rookies and this is gonna be fun to just relive those first moments with them uh, as they get into space and, and get to see their excitement and their expressions and joy. AX2 means there's a 2.0 to her career. And now she gets to help a wonderful company to take that next step in its mission. Uh, her congeniality and her manner, extremely comforting, and it gave me the confidence that I could do this. She is inspiring. Personally, I look up to her and I want to be like her. I don't know. I love everything about Peggy. She's my role model. I'm Axiom astronaut Peggy Whitson.